Whoa, where am I? It doesn't matter, because when I'm finished, no one will care about you or any celebrity. Except me, of course. Please, no, I'm late for set. <laughs> Mandy? Yeah, especially to us. What's all this stuff for, anyway? A talent scout is coming to Malayu, and I am gonna wow him with my signature walk. Uh, is she serious? Walking is her talent? Mm -hmm. huh? This I gotta see. You must be Mandy. seen a walk like that since I signed Helena Gorondova, world's greatest supermodel. <laughs> Unfortunately, you are no Helena. Goodbye. It, baby. You can't think that way, Johnny. I have a seriously infected hangnail, babe. And <laughs> doctors aren't holding out much hope. I need you to know how much I love you. Love in a railway station? This is mm. hands down my favorite Smith movie of all time. Rad is a total cutie. Question is, why is Jerry watching it? He obviously has great taste. Actually, girls, the movie is for research purposes only. A missing persons report was filed on Brad Smith early this morning when he went out for a jog and never returned. Oh, no! Rad is in the middle of filming the fourth sequel in his totally awesome Sunset series. First, there was love in a railway station, then love in a gas station, followed by love in a subway station. I hazard to guess what the fourth installment is called. Love in a space station? Can you imagine Rad's signature hair fluff in zero gravity? <sighs> I can honestly say no. 
You three are to go to Rad's mansion and look for clues. Well then, what are we huh? waiting for? Yeah, load us up, Jer, and we'll be on our way. You'll need the frequency modulator mood ring, buzzsaw wristwatch, icy fresh liquid nitrogen breath spray, ruby red lipstick laser, and diamond cutter diamond earrings. Ooh, these will look fab when we hang with, uh, I mean, uh, save Rad Smith. I'm sure they will. Now, goodbye, spies, and good luck. Brad is the number one celebrity in the world. It's not like we can just go up to the door and ring the bell. That's why we've got these. Cable TV installers? Great thinking, Sammy. Now, any idea on how to get through Rad's state-of-the-art security system and his bodyguard? Whoa! Hmm. Time for a little frequency modulation, courtesy of Jer's mood ring. believe how seriously Rad takes his movie memorabilia. This place is a total shrine. I can't believe Clover is trying on someone's ratty old headgear. Cowboy Love Story was not only one of my top five movies last year, it totally changed my life. I now realize how completely cute cowboys can be. The Golden Toast Award? Rad was the toast of Tinseltown three years running. Ew! Who keeps their nasty old bandages and frames them? <gasps> That's not just any bandage, Sammy. That's the bandage from the movie we saw playing in Jerry's office. It won Rad his first platinum orb. <gasps> okay, spies. Time to focus on finding some actual clues. <laughs> Brad Smith? Who are you? And what are you doing in my closet? Um... We're, uh... <clears throat> from Newcom Cable. Here to upgrade your satellite feed. Hmm. The question is, are you okay? You don't look so good. I am the leading romantic actor on Earth. Why wouldn't I be okay? Uh, for starters, your shoes are covered in mud and you're inside the house. Any idea where it came from? Uh, not to mention the fact that you were reported missing. How can I be missing when I'm standing right here? You three know a lot for cable TV installers. We're just Humongo fans. Think you could do your signature move for me? Signature... move? Uh-oh. Um, we can explain. Um, we already filled him in. See ya! Some 
nuts and bolts get the best of us. Eat my super spy dust! <laughs> a little strange. More than a little. He had no idea how to do his signature move. The one he's famous for. And he couldn't remember how he got all that dried up mud on his sneakers. Or went missing in the first place. I'll send you the mud sample to see if it holds any clues. And let him know that Rad's returned to his mansion. Hmm. As much as I hate to leave Bel Air, we have to get back to school. Right behind you, Clover. Hmm. Ugh. Let me guess. You're about to show the world that you practically invented melodrama? What abs? Luckily, I managed to convince the talent scout to give me another shot. No thanks to that awful porker of yours. Speaking of Winky, have you seen him around? No. And make sure you keep that hog out of my way. <laughs> I'm looking for a serious actress with serious acting chops. Serious? You got it. I've seen enough. Good day. <laughs> Your stupid lame pig is ruining everything! <laughs> yep. Totally melodramatic. Huh? Hello, girls. Don't tell me you have the results of the mud analysis already. Unfortunately, I'm calling with a slightly more pressing matter. International singing sensation Jason Weebler has just been reported missing. Oh, no! Not the Jason Weebler! Oh, I just love his hit single! Sweetie, 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 oh! That's not all. There was a third abduction attempt on Spanish soccer star Alessandro. <gasps> Alessandro is my majorly hot jock crush. No one can strike it like Sandro. Yes, well, you girls are to head to Spain immediately in case another abduction attempt is made. You got it, Jeer. When do we leave? No time like the present. <laughs> <laughs> First things first, we'll need to blend. Uh, looks 
like he's got some high-tech help. Huh? No! My lucky ball! <gasps> Sandro's moves definitely defy gravity! We've got to help him! Grab those balls! <laughs> <laughs> help! Help! What is it, Sammy? You look like you've seen a ghost. Hmm. Sort of. There was a CH logo on the Zeppelin's tail rudder. It seems so familiar. So why can't I place it? <laughs> Jer, the villain just made off with Alessandro. Oh, dear. Any update on that mud? It's mud from the Hollywood Hills. You're to head back there and see if you can unearth any more clues. That never gets old, Jer. If we wanted some dirt on Rad, we'd have better luck watching Access Bel Air. Wait! I think I've got something! Over here! Hmm? Hmm. Those footprints definitely belong to Rad Smith. Okay, how could you possibly know that, Clover? While we were hiding in Rad's closet, I checked out his shoes. Bob's. Hmm. He had six pairs of identical sneaks, just like the pair he was wearing. Way to sleuth, Clover. But it still doesn't explain why they suddenly disappear. No, but this does. A trap door! Buzzsaw wristwatch, do your thing. underground lair. <gasps> Whoa! Not just any lair, it's a way posh underground mansion! <gasps> what is that? Oh, no! <gasps> Jason Weebler! Oh. Alessandro! <gasps> Uh-oh, I think I just figured out what the CH logo on the plane stands for, Sammy! I wish I could say it was nice to see you nosy little spies again. Unfortunately, I can't, because it isn't. Let me guess. You came down with another nasty case of celebrity worship syndrome. You should really have yourself checked by a doctor. <laughs> nice try. But I got tired of merely hanging around celebs, so I decided to become one myself. Um... Don't you have to be, you know, famous to be a celebrity? A mere technicality. Thanks to my trusty machine that steals talents from the world's greatest stars. <laughs> you stole Rad's signature move! You monster! I've also stolen Rad's acting chops. Soon, I'll have Jason Weedler's singing voice and Alessandro's soccer moves. And that's just the beginning. Oh, no! <laughs> Sweetie, 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 oh, like sweetie, 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 oh, please always be mine. No way! Captain Hayes is a totally talented singer and soccer player now! Not to mention completely irresistible! But there is no way! 
way we're falling for it. Glad you enjoyed the show. Now, if you'll excuse me, it's time. When my mansion emerges, they will rename this place the Hayes Hills after me and my many talents. <laughs> <laughs> what was he talking about when my mansion emerges? Who knows? Most of the villains we deal with are certifiably crazy. Come on, spies. We have a quadruple threat to take down. Singer, actor, sports hero, and total laps. No. Unfortunately, this cage is made from a carbon compound as strong as diamonds. Luckily, nothing cuts through diamonds like diamond cutter diamond earrings. Uh, uh, great work, Clover! Now let's free Jason Weebler and Alessandro, then put an end to Captain Hayes' bogus fame grab. Right behind you, Sammy! Person. Could I have your autograph? Uh, I can't believe I'm gonna say this, but enough crushing! Hello? There's an international villain down the stairs! <gasps> no, that sounds like an earthquake! Hurry! We've got a rising star to snap out! Unfortunately, you're much too late for that. <laughs> Watch out! <laughs> <laughs> Didn't you know that Rad played a world-famous circus performer in one of his many flicks? Yes, I totally knew that. I just thought it was special effects. Consider yourselves lucky. You've got front row seats for the debut of the soon-to-be iconic Captain Hayes. <laughs> this show stinks. Yeah, I demand a refund. <laughs> Alex, think you can reach into my pocket and grab the lipstick laser? I think so. No! Got it! Great save, Clover. Time to immobilize this would-be idol. Hmm? It is sweet, it's sweet, it oh. Please always be mine. Ah! Oh! Back! <laughs> Way to plunge that loser in a super cold obscurity, Sammy! Hello, girls. Another job well done, spies. It's hard to get excited with the Hollywood Hills in shambles. Never fear, a whoop disaster cleanup crew is on the way as we speak. What's going to happen to the totally unfab Captain Hayes now? He'll be going to our Whoop Containment Facility, where the only thing he'll be famous for is being a criminal. Don't forget to restore Alice.
surrender to his former glory. His team's in the semi-finals next week. Yes, yes. We'll also restore Jason Weebler's singing voice and Rad Smith's questionable acting ability. Wouldn't want to deprive the world of love in a space station. Speaking of which, think you can get us front row ticks to his big movie premiere next week? <sighs> Dear? Dear? Oh, I'm sure he'll get right on it. This is your last, last chance, Mandy. Trust me. You will not be disappointed. <laughs> Cue the music! I've seen enough! <laughs> you mean you've heard enough, right? Who is the owner of that precocious pig? He has perfect timing. I want to sign him immediately. His name's Oinky. Oinky's going to be bigger than Jason Weebler. <laughs> <laughs>